What's up, everybody? This is Dave here from DroidInsider.com to do a review of the uh, Mean ROM. This is version 4.3. Um, I've done a couple of reviews on Mean ROM, and this is one Mean ROM. Uh, I'm getting incredible speeds on it, and uh, everything just is incredibly responsive. Um, very cool. Uh, let's get Lynn back on here. 83 right off the bat 104 and consistent results just because 84 I'm telling you I mean just 84 that's incredible um, just right off the bat 88 um, I have not done any overclocking just installed the ROM as is I'm sure the uh, Dodava kernel I hope I'm saying that right. Um, might be already overclocked, I don't know. Um, 91. I mean, these are really good speeds on here. 92. They're just getting better. Um, I ran a quadrant, and um, I, I can't see the results after you ran one. I'll go ahead and run another one. Um, the first one came up at, I think it was 3,500, um, which... I personally haven't gotten a quadrant score that good uh, before. Um, I installed this pretty much with nearly a dead battery, and uh, the battery percentage hasn't gone down yet, so um, it does seem like good battery, but uh, you know, I might leave on the comments later if uh, I notice really good or bad battery life. But, um, uh, going off the other ROMs I've installed from uh, Mean ROM, they definitely have good battery life and uh, really good speeds. Um, trying to think of what my last video on uh, Mean ROM, what version it was. I think it was two point something. Let's see here. On my last one, I was. Mean ROM 2.2, so they definitely have done some updates, and I can definitely tell the speed difference here. Yeah, I've been having some issue out of uh, Quadrant Standard. I ran three before I finally got it to give me the score. I was hoping it was going to run fine there. Um, it's pagnated page tier, um, no, uh, tweaks that can be applied as far as through the settings or, um, in an app down here. Uh, it's got the Amaze camcorder and camera and mirror. Um, it's got a... ES File Explorer comes on. I love the flashlight right there. Just the three different brightnesses. You can see they're really bright. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Regular. It's got another mirror on there. The basic mirror. I installed Linpack. Uh, it's got the music. I don't know if this is the one. Uh, although I think it's most likely got some, yeah, it's got Beats Audio in it. And it allows you to do Beats Audio without a headphone plugged in, which I know that's hard to see on here, but, um, they, uh, a lot of some of the other ones, you know, you have to have the headphones plugged in for that Beats Audio to take effect. Let's see here, anything else on the Sprint Hotspot and Wi Fi Tether? Wi Fi Tether does work. Uh, going down the pull down menu. I know this is awfully bright. I don't know if it gets any better by changing angle here. Probably not. Uh, so it shows your notifications. Nice bright white, not uh, transparent, hard to see, nothing there. Um, auto brightness. Uh, might bring it down a little bit. Maybe that made it a little easier to see. If you don't grab it on that, there it goes. Maybe that made it easier. See, I'm not sure. You let me know. Uh, so it's got a couple of just the basic um, added 
quick settings there and it does run pretty low uh, used to RAM 488 so uh, that's pretty low and being well, actually 467 being used so um, it's got power saver on it allows you to get those high percentage of uh, batteries if your battery is always dying in the day, which I'm starting to realize now because my new job's got me where I'm not near a charger all day long. And a couple times my battery's just dead halfway through the day and I'm not even using it. So uh, I'm definitely going for battery life over high speeds, but this is already shown to be uh, a good boast. Um, since installing the ROM, I've been at 19% and uh, it's held there, so you know, while running these quadrant and Linpack scores. So, um, as far as a 3D camera, I'm sure it works. Uh, let's see. Of course, I'm not going to see anything because it's so dark. Let me see real quick. 3D does work. It's just so dark back here, you can't even tell. So, uh, 3D and 2D does work down here. So, but definitely a ROM we're checking out with a good battery life and incredible speeds here. Just good response and uh, everything. Definitely something you want to check out. So, uh, head over to uh, see Mike Y X D A on XDA's website for their newest uh, version which does change very often uh, they constantly do a lot of updates and changes every mod they can so definitely check it out let me know what you think of the video please hit that like button definitely helps uh, don't forget to subscribe and if you already are I appreciate it thanks guys hey guys just wanted to show you the uh, boot up phase real quick of the uh, Mean ROM, uh, which is new and uh, very cool in my opinion. I really like how they got the 3D graphics and info coming up there. That took about all of you know eight seconds to boot up. So, all right, guys, thanks.